when it comes to intonation on the bassoon, there's not much you can do in terms of pushing in or pulling out any part of the instrument that's going to make a very big difference. So it's best not to even bother doing that. This makes it different from the other woodwinds where you can adjust by pulling joints out or pushing them in. On the bassoon, what really sets the general level of pitch is the reed, the embouchure, and the air. And if you have a good reed and you're playing with a good embouchure and a good airstream, you should be in the ballpark. Now, what if you're not? One thing you can do is to look at the length of bocal. The bocal is rated in three lengths. Well, four actually. Um, zero through three, and the smaller the number, the shorter the bocal will be. And the shorter the bocal, the higher the pitch. The longer the bocal, the lower the pitch. The most common length of bocal is what we usually call a number two bocal. That's a nice middle ground. You want to make sure that you don't have any zeros or ones in your bassoon cases because that will really make the pitch go up pretty drastically. Now, an important thing to know about bocal lengths is that they're not entirely standard, unfortunately. Fox bocals, which if you have a fox bassoon, it'll come with fox bocals. Fox bocals kind of exist in their own universe in terms of numbering. The fox bocals are one number higher than the rest bocals. So a fox three is equivalent to a normal uh, number two bocal. So you have to keep that in mind when you're looking at your bocals. Now, what do you do if you have a bassoonist in your group and they're sharp or they're flat and you can't tell them to push, push in or pull out or any of those things? The way we control intonation on the bassoon, given a setup that we have with the reed and the embouchure in the air, is really with tongue position. And what you can have your students do is try to create more or less space inside their mouth to make the pitch lower or higher. You can do this in a couple ways. You can have them think of different vowel sounds. E, the sound E will bring the back of the tongue up, which will make less space. It'll bring the pitch up. The sound A ah or O will bring the tongue down, which will make the pitch lower. So you can have them oscillate through E and O sounds. I'm just moving my tongue around inside my mouth. I'm not changing anything here. I'm not moving my jaw, just my tongue. The other thing you can have them do if the, the vowels aren't really working and they're sharp, which is more likely to be the case is to have them think of having something inside their mouth, like a, a boiled egg or an Easter egg. And that'll give them the sense of, oh, I've got to have space. My tongue's got to be down low to make room. Also, if you make sure that their tongue is anchored to the tip, with the tip of the tongue to the back of their lower lip, like oh, that will also promote space inside the mouth. And it'll also give them a way to have a point of stability as they move the tongue up and down further back in the mouth. If your student is flat, it could be because they have too much room in the mouth. That's not too common. The more common reason for being flat is lack of air support. So, you can have them practice blowing up the pitch just by moving their air faster. And those are some of the common intonation intonation techniques. Now, particular notes that tend to be bad, watch out for the half hole G and the half hole F sharp. Those tend to be sharp notes. If the G is bad, make sure they have their E flat key down. That'll bring the pitch down. Make sure they're open for those notes. Also, make sure that in the lower register, low F and below, that's F2, that they're really open, embouchure is loose, and the air is slow but supported and that should be able to help with some of the some of the problems down there notes above the bass clef staff in the bassoon particularly d e flat e and f 
tend to be flat. So they'll need to think a very focused embouchure, lots of corners, and very fast air. And that will help to, to blow those notes up as well.